Hey, ladies and gentlemen, this is Carmine Sabia for Explain America, and former President Donald Trump has spoken out about the indictment of Hunter Biden, and it's not the answer that I think any of us imagined. Before we get started, please make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Those little things really help us out, and they help our channel continue to grow. So the former president was being interviewed by Kristen Welker, who's the new anchor of NBC, the NBC show Meet the Press, which will be airing on Sunday with a full interview with former President Trump. However, the interview was conducted this week and leads into, of course, Sunday. But there was a particular clip that was shared online by, you know, Meet the Press, where it broke during the interview that Hunter Biden was indicted. And Trump gave a response that I think it took me by surprise I think it took a lot of people by surprise, and I want to know if you're surprised by it. Let's take a look at it. Let's talk about the breaking news today. We learned just a short time ago that the president's son, Hunter Biden, was indicted by a federal grand jury on three gun charges. Given that, Mr. President, can you continue to say that there are two systems of justice? Well, I think there's no question about it. He had a plea deal that was the deal of the century, uh, the art of the deal. You could write a book on it, the art of the deal. Uh, and all of a sudden, that was broken up by a judge who was able to, a brilliant judge, actually, who was able to see through what was happening. And it's a sad situation. I mean, nobody should be happy about this. I'm not happy about it. Nobody is. It's a very sad thing. It's so bad for our country. Uh, but, you know, if you think about it, I've been under investigation from the day I came down the escalator and a phony investigation, fake investigations, investigations that I beat every single time, still under investigations. But it's a very sad thing and it's a uh, slippery slope but Mr. and Biden dangerous, very dangerous for our country. Now, the president, he understands about being indicted. He understands about being investigated. He said that as much in the interview. And so for him to have sympathy, for him to say he's not celebrating it, I think is, is big of him. I'm not celebrating it either. Um, and I have questions. You know, I have a lot of questions about the indictment. You know, would anybody else be indicted for this particular charge if they weren't the son of the president? It, it's tough to imagine, you know. So you have to wonder if political pressure plays a role on both sides. Um, he broke a law, yes. But is it something most prosecutors would pursue? Now, I think there are bigger issues that were not charged, but we learned today that the special counsel said more indictments may be coming. This is just the beginning. So there could be much bigger cases that Hunter has to worry about besides these firearms charges. And that, I think, you know, that's the stuff that maybe connects to President Joe Biden. We don't know yet, and that's what the investigation is for. That's what trials are for. That's what House investigations are for. That's what all that's for. So I'm interested to know exactly how far this goes. I want to know what you think. Do you think they were being too tough on Hunter Biden? Do you think they're being too lenient on Hunter Biden? Were you surprised by Trump's more, like, kind of, kind of response to it? Let me know in the comments. Also, please make sure you like, share, and subscribe, because that really helps us out. I'm Carmine Sabia. This is Explain America. We love you guys. God bless you. Take care, everybody.